All right, guys, let's now study about the linking verbs, okay? So, now, linking verbs are the types of verbs that links the subject of a sentence with a subject complement. Don't get scared. I'm going to explain what is a subject complement, okay? Just hold on. So, which can be a noun, pronoun, or adjective. And it gives information about the subject. It's going to take you back to the subject. So, linking verbs do not, do not show an action. Instead, they describe or identify a subject. For example... Some of the some common linking verbs include is, am, are, was, were, appear, become, seem, look, feel. Now here are some examples for you, and in this I'm try I've tried to you know make it as simpler as as simple as possible uh, to actually show you and explain you uh, in, with the terms of parts of speech by breaking down each word in a sentence. Okay, well not exactly each word, but uh, I hope you get the idea. So here are some examples of sentences that use linking verbs. Uh, for example, very simple sentence, okay? She is a doctor. She is a doctor. So let me number them out for you. All right. She is a doctor. Now, let's break it down and let's try to understand that what does each word is doing in the sentence, okay? And what is the connection between each word? For example, in a sentence, in the sentence, she is a doctor, is links the subject she, she is a subject, okay? She is the subject. You know, that person is the subject of the sentence. She, subject with the subject complement doctor. Subject complement doctor means I'm telling about her profession. So that's the subject complement, okay? So what exactly the subject uh, is, okay? Uh, I'm, I'm not going to say exactly uh, the adjective, okay? But this describes it, okay? In the, in the next sentence, we're going to be having an, an example related to an adjective, okay? And you all know what is an adjective. So, second sentence says, the, flower, the flowers look beautiful. The flowers look beautiful, okay? Let's break it down. In this sentence, look links to the subject flowers, okay? Look, a commanding verb, okay? Uh, uh, sorry, not, uh, not commanding verb, a linking verb. So, the flowers look beautiful, so in this sentence, the look links the subject flower with the subject complement beautiful. Okay. He seems tired. Now seems over here is links the subject he. Okay. Seems, which is actually the uh, linking verb over here. It links the subject he with the subject complement tired. It's actually telling about the subject. Okay. By adding a linking verb. That the subject is what? Tired. Or he looks like tired. He seemed to be tired. Okay. So they were excited to go to the beach. Okay. This is a little bit pretty, a little bit long one. A little longer one. In this sentence, they were. They means the subject, the people. Were. Were links the subject. They. Okay. With the subject complement excited. Very simple. They all are very pretty simple to understand. I'm feeling better today. In this sentence, I am links the subject i with the subject com with the subject complement better okay for example so it's simple i am feeling better today i as the subject m telling about the current state of being remember in the classroom i gave an example it tells about the current state of being of that particular subject okay uh, that what that subject is uh, feeling doing happen well, like what is happening with the subject at the moment or what is the condition the state of a subject okay like for example the first state of the subject was that the subject is a doctor okay and uh, how am i supposed to tell it by adding a uh, word is which is our commanding oh sorry linking verb i'm again again repeating command uh, commanding i don't know what's wrong with me i guess i'm tired <laughs> okay so links with the subject i with a subject complement better very simple now, here is a list of uh, some commanding verbs for you, okay? So, uh, you just can uh, take a screenshot or pause the video and try to understand by yourself and maybe make sentences. By the way, we have that exercise coming up for you, okay? I hope you are, have seen all of it, all of them. Then, now here are some examples of linking verbs. She is a doctor. He seems tired. The cake smells delicious. They feel happy. The flowers look beautiful. The music sounds soothing. Now, it's your job to actually identify 
the parts of speech over here. What is a subject? What is a linking verb? And what is a complement of the subject? Okay, I've explained all these things up there. Then here's again another exercise for you guys. So choose the correct linking verb in the following questions. Which of the following is a linking verb over here? Which of the following sentences has a linking verb? Okay, here are some sentences we are having over here. So choose wisely. Again, number three, the soup smells delicious. Which of the following linking verb in a sentence? What is a linking verb over here? What is a linking verb in a sentence? Here is a sentence for you. Here is another one for you. Here is another one. Then we are having which of the following is a linking verb? More, more and more examples for you to, you know, I, to, to broaden your perspective about it. What is a linking verb in a sentence? And two more. All right. Now we have again an exercise. Make 10 sentences using the following linking verbs. So these were not the only linking verbs, but if, as you can see that we have just done a couple of exercises up there with examples. So you have now a big vast list of uh, the linking verbs over there. Now I'm just going to go back and I'm going to end this video right now. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for coming up and watching another video. Please like, share, subscribe, uh, comment now. It really helps and motivates me to make such useful content for you guys as well. So yep, uh, see you in the next video. And yep, assalamu alaikum.